people, hi, how are you? My name is Lucy and Karibuni Sana to my YouTube channel. So today, hey, what a kwanza ni wache yo. Let me stop doing that. I need to introduce myself to you people. My name is Lucy Ngira and welcome to my YouTube channel, Karibuni Sana. So today, today we are going to make pilau, pilau, the easiest, simplest, uh, and it, it's just the, uh, the best way, quickest way of making pilau, pilau. So uh, it's going to be very simple pilau and very yummy, very mwah. Yeah, I'm going to make it simple and yummy. So the things we're going to need are very, very few. We need very few ingredients to this our pilau. So uh, the first thing we're going to need is our rice, whole yeah? grain rice. Can you see that? It's not washed yet, but we're going to wash it thoroughly before we start cooking it. And then another thing we need is onions. We need our onions. I love a lot of onions. I love onions in pilau because that is a game changer by the way. If you didn't know, I know now you know. The game changer to the pilau, best pilau, your onions. Yeah, so make sure you have a lot of onions. And here we need our garlic. I have not crushed all of them. I'm still crushing. Yeah, you need your garlic. So make sure you have your garlic with you. For me, I don't use ginger. So I'm going with garlic. I told you I'm going to make it simple, but yummy. That's what I'm going to do. So we need our garlic. We need dania. For me, somehow dania is optional because if I don't have dania, I'll still have my pilau. So uh, don't stress if you don't have dania. You can just make your pilau and have it the best way. So another thing we have, we need is our pilau masala. Of course, you need this. You need pilau masala. Yes, you go. But any pilau masala, if you need whole, mine is grounded pilau masala, and that's how I love it. I'm just going to put the grounded pilau masala, and then we need oil, cooking oil. Yeah, we need this cooking oil. Make sure you don't minimize your cooking oil. Make sure you put enough of it for your pilau to come out. Hmm. You know, if you get it, get it. You get it or you don't get it. <laughs> and then we need our soy sauce. Soy sauce to me, it's optional. So it's not like when I don't have soy sauce, I'm not going to have my pilau. I still have it as long as I have my onions. So I don't really like using soy sauce. But I just thought I should just let you know that you can also use soy sauce in your pillow. Yeah. So we need this, and of course we need water, we need maji, yeah? So we are going to make our simple pilau the easiest way, the funniest, because we're going to have fun while making it, because it's not going to be that hard. Hey, hey, we are making beef pilau. Hala, what is wrong with me? Yes, my beef is cooking. I think it's cooking, that's why. <laughs> that's why I need to include it here. Oui, oui, it's there. It's already cooking. So we're going to make beef pilau. We need beef too. <laughs> oh, how could I forget beef? Hanyam, hanyam, hanyam. Apia hakuenda, hakuenda. So that's how we're going to make our pilau. Easiest way within by doing my pilau within 15 minutes. Mm -mm. It's very much ready. As long as everything is ready, 15 minutes preparing and all that. When I start cooking, five minutes, I'm done. Yeah, that's how I cook my pilau and it comes out. Mm -hmm. So let's get into the cooking. And hey, I know you, you, you thought I had forgotten. If you're new here, Kariburi Sana, welcome to this happy and fun channel, yeah? Where we learn to cook clean, organized, motherhood, we do storytelling together, so welcome so much, I know you're going to have a lot of fun, yeah, staying, joining us, and for those 
those who are always here, always here with me. Uh -uh. Thank you so much. Now, Andy Sana, I love you so much. And thank you for always taking your time to come and just join us. So, thank you. Let's get into the kitchen and give this video a thumbs up. I know it's going to be wow. Give it a thumbs up. Please share, share, and also please turn your notification bell on down there. All these other things are down there. You see the cabell and then the liking uh, uh, part, the is also there. You have to share also. Yeah, please do that for a sister. We are on the way to a thousand subscribers. We're almost, we're almost, we have at 600 classes. Happy dance, happy dance, happy dance. Eh, 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 eh. We are growing, we are growing. So let's go so um i had already cooked my meat my meat is very ready so i'm just frying it to make it a little bit uh brownish i'm not going to make it so dried eh? like I, I don't want to fry it to become so hard because i have kids so and the kids are going all, are also going to have this pilau so i'm just going to make them uh, the meat brown kidogo as i'm doing that my my onions today i fried my onions uh, separately because i wanted them to cook um faster so i decided to fry them separately so what i'm going to do i'm going to add them in the meat right away because too like uh, i put the meat the meat was already frying and then i decided to put the on what was i even doing so if i could have done this earlier it could have been better but because i started i started late i'll have to just mix them together so that they can cook together so i'm going to add my onions into the meat so that they can uh, cook together i want my onions to be golden brown don't allow let never let uh, your onions to burn or when you're cooking pilau I think any meal because the one at the moment the onions are burnt that means your meal is going to be very bitter kali sana so be very careful yeah and also because we want color to our pilau we're going to make sure our onions are very well cooked golden brown is the color that we're looking at here so um uh, at the moment they are already brown i'm going to add in my garlic and let my garlic cook together with the onion not uh, that I added the garlic together with the onion when I started cooking the onions. I let my onions to cook first before adding the garlic. Because if you do, if you put them together, unless you don't want your onions to cook well, never make that mistake because your onions, uh, your garlic will burn before the onions are well cooked so i have to wait for my onions to cook well and then add my garlic and then after that i'm going to add um i'm going to add my pilau masala that's the only uh, spice i'm going to use this pilau masala yeah so after i am doing that i'm going to add water remember i added salt in the meat when the meat was cooking so i'm not going to add salt here because I'm sure I put enough salt here. So I'm going to add water and then I uh, know I'm going to add my rice. And then after adding my rice, that's when I'll add water. And remember to always boil your water before adding into the into the rice. So my water uh, is already boiled. So I'm going to add boiled water in this rice. And also I have uh, danias here, coriander. I'm going to. I'm not going to add coriander immediately. I'll add coriander after the pilau is ready. Kisha Eva, That's when I'm going to add my coriander. Yeah, that's what I'm going to do. And um, yeah, um, uh, uh, my pilau was one kg. That is like four glasses, and I've added like uh, eight glasses of water yeah ratio is one is to two i believe you know that so yeah let's wait for it to get ready and enjoy our pilau 
<laughs> uh, our pilau is ready and ready to be munched. So let's enjoy this together. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much for always being here with me. Thank you so much for getting your time to just come and join me. So I love you so much. Make sure you turn on your notification bell so that you don't miss out anytime I post my videos. Yeah, see you. See you in my next video. Bye.